I know you told me Such a long time ago That you didn't want me You didn't love me no more Alright, well today we actually got up kind of early because I've been on my new grind. Also for the video, of course, I gotta try to do more stuff today, but introducing the habit tracker. I highly recommend this. Such a simple thing. I just have all my things I want to do in the day, like my daily routine, and then I'll put X's. Go to bed before 12 a.m. Uh, this whole month, I only did one, and that was last night, so I could wake up early and film this video. That one we're working on. Clean your room for 10 minutes. I am very consistent at this. Yeah, so we're just gonna do the daily routine and Let's start the day off with a little reading, which I don't know why I smiled. Reading is cool. Okay, so every day now I try to read 10 pages, which sounds so lame, but I'm honestly just not the reader type, which I definitely need reading because my vocabulary and grammar is probably like third grade level. I come on the balcony and try to get some sunlight. Kelly let me borrow this book by David Goggins. Pretty crazy book. You are giving up instead of getting hard. <laughs> pretty like straight up but it's definitely like motivational and it makes me want to go work out or get hyped for the day and that's when i usually go see what kelly's doing and bother him oh 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 what are you doing getting ready to <laughs> <laughs> but i feel like it's not daily routine if i don't come and bother kelly for at least five minutes so terrible you need some david goggins in your life you look tired my boy you need to get hyped the one with the book. here put these on and you'll get hyped <laughs> That's gotta do what it's like Straight like that, no chaser I need you in my life Show me right now what you're made of Gotta do what it's like Finally got back to my standards I was let it go, let it go Luke goes to the gym for once Now I'm hyped up, can we go to the gym? You afraid to drop a dime when you already dropped a dime Got a wife at home but you steady on my line so we actually have a gym in our apartment, which is amazing. Now I cannot make any excuses of not being consistent at the gym. Not only do I feel like the gym wakes me up, I think it's just super important to be active, lifting weights, even though sometimes it is boring. It's good to include in your everyday routine. It's what people say. I honestly have no idea. On days like this where I'm in my hoodie and feeling a little tired, I like to uh, try to take a cold shower. This has been my daily, my daily eat. I'll make an omelet with whatever's in the fridge. It's always good. Now I've been cooking a lot, going to Trader Joe's. Yeah, trying to save money. But this is like just as good, I realize, as a coffee shop and making coffee and stuff. It just adds up of like saving. You know what's bad that I lean on this now? When we first moved here, I was super scared to just be on the balcony. And now I just leaned on the glass. Probably shouldn't do that. I have not been outside yet. Eventually, I want to go do some like New York touristy thing before it gets dark, because it gets dark super early now. I also need to clean my room. It's on the project tracker. Hey Ari, can you come look at my room? Remember last time you are like, he only cleans it for the camera. Yeah, that's what I'm saying, dude. The last one, he's like, oh, everybody look at my clean room. And it's like, it always looks like this. What do you mean? I've never seen your floor. Or this empty my entire life. I don't know what you're talking about. Turn that camera around, buddy. This is what it looks like every day. Dude, usually it's clean at my 10 <laughs> minutes a day. Yeah, that habit tracker, not going too well. <laughs> No, look at the look at the track though. Check, 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 check. Just oh, today. Oh, it's because I've been filming. You work out today? No. Oh wait, no, I did. I did. Go check it off. Yeah, I know. I didn't check it yet. Start your daily routine with the 10 minute clean of your room. Oh, that's nice. And cut. Ah, <laughs> better, way better. 10 minutes of cleaning does a lot. Okay, so I've been trying to just get out more and explore, especially because I live in New York and there's so many things that I have not seen yet. So I've been trying to include that into my routine of just exploring a little and trying out new things. Oh gosh, this is sketch. Oh, this is kind of a cool shot. All right, I'm on the bike. Hopefully my camera doesn't fall. 
Holy. This is so shaky. We're just gonna go to the ferry station, hop on a ferry, and go somewhere random. I have no idea where, though. We made it on a boat. I have no idea where we're going. This is crazy. This shot is really probably shaky, too. Whoa, whoa. We're going under the bridge. Whoa, this is sick. It's crazy that I don't do stuff like this all the time. Like, it's so pretty. It happens to be sunset, and it's only 4.50. Oh, the Statue of Liberty. I need to go outside more. Hello? Yeah, I'm working on it right now. I mean, I'm not stressing too hard. I'm just trying to make the best quality product. I think I got it. This song thing isn't that hard. Ooh, spoke too soon, Loki Pookie. Just a clumsy guy trying to make some cool clothes. Let's rewind to 2015, when 15-year-old Luke tried starting a skate brand called Keikoa, inspired by his Hawaiian middle name. He sold a few shirts he printed in his garage, but ended up losing money because he forgot to charge for shipping. Classic Luke. In 2019, Luke revived Keikoa with better designs, more product, and remembering to charge for shipping this time. But eventually Keikoa faded, and Luke thought the name was a bit tough to say. Luke loved making clothes, but wanted a name that wasn't just about the brand. It was about a certain way of living. He often stressed about small things and overthought decisions that didn't really matter. That's when no pressure was born. A lifestyle about going with the flow and keeping a stress-free mindset. It was all about enjoying life with as few worries as possible. A reminder for Luke to live in the moment and just have a good time, hoping to inspire others to do the same. The first No Pressure launch in September 2022 was a hit, and the support meant the world to Luke. Seeing people adopt this stress-free lifestyle is so cool to see. November saw the second drop, and then another in February, turning No Pressure into a creative outlet for Luke and a way to build a strong, like-minded community. However, Luke recently encountered a couple of setbacks. It's been nearly 10 months since the latest No Pressure drop, leaving everyone curious. What's the story behind No Pressure's hiatus? Breaking news, the infamous creator Luke Ike has been teasing a No Pressure drop for months now. It's been months and we still haven't seen it. And the question remains, where is he? Mm. No pressure, Luke. Oh, it's not a she. What's up, stress, Luke? I need your advice. Stressed out again today? Yeah. What are you doing? Just chilling, enjoying the view. Just chilling. Going with the flow, you know, just living, living life. It's nice. You should try it sometime. Well, I came to talk to you because I need some advice. Lay it to me, buddy. What's going on? You see, everyone's like pressuring me to. Well, I don't know if anyone's actually pressuring me to release this drop. I guess I'm just stressed now for no reason. I feel like you answered your own question. You know, 99% of things you worry about really never happened. Yeah, I guess that's true. Like, what's holding you back? No logos, nothing. i just been stressing. Okay, logos, that's doable. You could work with that. I think you just gotta, no pressure. Literally, our brand, it's a good point. Go with the flow, don't stress. Yeah, I'm just trying to make cool stuff. You'll figure it out. Chillax a little. You know what? I think I'm good. Thank you. All right, later. Hey, that boy's a stressor for real. Oh, it's backwards. Come on, let's go.
return to the Mac. Get up what it is, what it does, what it is, what it isn't. Looking for a better way to get up out of bed instead of getting on the internet and checking a new hit me. Get up. First shot, come strut walking. A little bit of humble, a little bit of cautious. Somewhere between like Rocky and Cosby, sweat a game. Nope, nope, we all can't copy. Yeah. releasing the newest Snow Pressure line. It's been almost a year since I've dropped. Finally very happy with this new collection. First off, we'll start off with my favorite hoodie. It's like an ash gray. And then it says, don't stress on the back. These I've been looking for forever. They're just like a quality hoodie. So like old garment was like, it was all right. But this one is like next level quality. In order to use this hoodie, we had to bump up the price. So I apologize that it's more expensive, but trust me, like these hoodies are so comfy. You could just wear them every day. I don't know how else to explain with being like, dang. It went up a little, but it'll last longer. The quality is just so much better. And that's why I feel like it's taken me so long to release. The new materials and the new garments, it's just like quality. Like this one is a great piece. I'm just gonna totally say that we used a Dickies blank. Cause Dickies is like super good quality. This is my little guy, my little friend. And then we got this woven patch. I was really trying to go crazy on the details. And then also we upgraded on the tag. Like honestly don't care about making money with no pressure. I just want like cool stuff that I actually wear all the time. So this stuff I'm just trying to make for you guys to rock. And also just make cool stuff that I like creating. So we got the little globe. This is kind of the classic tee, a white shirt. And we also have it in a, this color is called Dolphin Blue. This one is kind of, you know, if you're feeling a little crazy, mineral wash dye is what it's called. Yeah, same design as the one I'm wearing. Then we go over here, super excited. We finally have skateboards. We got the little smiley guys, the same Don't Stress logo. It's clean white. I feel like these two go really well. This line, I was just trying to do like more simple stuff that I'd wear all year round. Got my little guy right here, Steven. We also have an embroidered, no pressure. This garment is just so nice. So I think it's definitely worth it. And then we got this custom hat that I've been working on, I swear, for like six months. It's a puff print. I feel like I just went crazy custom on it, I was like, ah, let's just do the most. A little embroidered on the side. And then on here, we got a bunch of patches. These are just random patches I thought looked cool. We also got a tag on the back, no pressure tag. If you guys wanna go check out the website, nopressure.shop. We are only gonna be doing the sale for 72 hours, kind of the same as every other. Otherwise, thank you guys for all the support on the No Pressure brand. Seeing it on Instagram, and I've seen a couple people wearing it in real life, is honestly so crazy and appreciate it so much. So if you guys wanna go Go check it out. Great way of supporting, and then you can rock the stress-free lifestyle. You know, don't stress. Even though crazy hectic in New York, you gotta stay chill, like Steven. All right, let's get back to the day. It's not even that late. I man, but real. Yeah, we're gonna go to the gym so I can play Kelly in my daily one v one. Looks ready to take that daily L. Chelsea Pierce. Me and Kelly come about what? You say almost every day? Maybe me. To. Huh? <laughs> we just hack each other and trash talk. So today I'm gonna show the whole world who's really better. The trash talk begins already. We got oh. Shervin on the cam. Oh, <laughs> Alright, what do we play? I want a smoothie, so like loser gotta make the smoothie. Alright, you can shoot, so then I start. Shoot for the ball? Yeah. Alright, I start. And I just ran three miles. That's crazy. Oh my god, that is crazy. Please, wow, 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 wow. And one. Ah. Let him shoot that. <laughs> you can't go left though, I know that for a fact. Play against you every day, you still can't go left. <laughs> Don't poke the bear. <laughs> what was that? What do you mean? That was a bucket. You got this? No. Oh! <laughs> Give me some. Cut that red tail. I'm different. 
<laughs> you can't yell that I'm different to me. Good game. Good game. Can't put that in, huh? <laughs> Truth is, I always lose. You usually play better than that. Yeah, that was pretty bad. And your smack talk was not as good. Where's the confidence, Luke? Camera shy. See, where was that in the game? If we played again, I would totally win. Good win. No straw? <laughs> not bad. Thank you, bro. Did you just say to me? I said, like, next time. This could be you right now. Mm, you know, okay. Work on your shooting. Work on your heart, dude. You need more David Goggins in your life. So let's say one pet peeve about each other since we moved into the house. Sometimes I'm trying to sleep and Luke decides to do his laundry at, like, 1.30 in the morning and then the laundry machine just starts fucking so loudly. You leave your freaking probe out for days. That was one day. You leave your lights on? Yeah. <laughs> what are we gonna watch on TV? Jack Doherty. We're on a streaming grind. So we're watching this kid live stream. I don't know, they just like live stream their life and we're just like so confused. Not making fun, but. For sure. But we don't wanna be mean. Uh, okay, I won't say anything bad. But... Kelly's gonna comment and I think it says it out loud. Oh. This is funny, dude. <laughs> we're waiting. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, this is what we actually do all day. Wait, you donated? <laughs> we just go on Twitch and comment on people's live stream. What are we doing? Luke Huck and Kelly McCarthy want you to cover to their crib in NYC and join their making heads for a very long time. Do what excites. 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 Suck my dick. Now I can't even ask. What? <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what did he say? <laughs> he said, my What are you doing? <laughs> you just said something else. You look 30%, nah. You have five. Yeah, zero. Yeah, you know, that it? That was it. What did it say? Luke Luke has a huge crush on you. No pressure, drop on Wednesday. <laughs> what? Good night. No, bro. Wanna bed? Yeah. Yeah, good night. J1G. J1G. Just like a little montage. Trail off the gas. Justin Bieber? I just never understand. <laughs>